The evening before Thanksgiving is one of the busiest travel times of the year. 22 News reporter Matt Karen has been monitoring the traffic live from the Ludlow rest stop. Yeah, well, the good news is a lot of headlights in the background, but not a lot of tail lights, at least where we are right off the highway in Ludlow. Traffic is moving pretty smoothly. I spent the day surveying different methods of Thanksgiving travel. It was busy at Bradley International Airport when we went there this afternoon. The TSA lines were long. And of course, airfare is the cheapest that it's been since 2013. It was a little less busy over at Union Station in Springfield, where train travel seemed to take a backseat to the buses. And on the road is where 90% of travelers will be, despite gas prices being 50 cents a gallon higher than last year. I talked to one woman who said she enjoys the travel. It's not stressful. It's a lot of fun and I enjoy every moment of it. Right now I'm at the Union Station and I'm traveling to Boston Logan, Air Boston Logan Airport and then I will take a plane and I will travel overseas. AAA recommends just to be safe, plan on tripling the time that it usually takes you to get to your destination to be sure that you make it on time. Nearly 51 million people will travel at least 50 miles or more this year. That's the most in a dozen years. Live in Ludlow, Matt Karen, 22 News. And that brings us to tonight's 22 News interactive internet poll question. We asked if you're traveling out of town for Thanksgiving. Just log on to our website, wwlp.com, and click your vote. We'll have the results tonight on 22 News at 10 and 11.